Hi everyone, it's Maria. Welcome to Life in Yakutia channel. Today it's an ordinary winter day. It's very sunny and I think it's negative 44 degrees Celsius. This is very common weather and uh, it's a nice weather. <laughs> and today I want to show you how we heat our house in winter. First, I will tell how we insulate and heat our wooden house, and then we will show you the temperatures inside. This is my parents' house. Uh, it was built in 2008. It's heated from September till May, nine months a year. This house is around 150 square meters in total. This is a wooden house, the name of the wood is here i don't know it's in english it's teak <laughs> and between the wood trunks here is a toe oak can you can you show it i think it's called toe or oak in english and we put it here to uh, make this house more insulated so the cold air doesn't go inside of the building but uh, birds really like this material and they take it out every year we make additional um, work to edit but sometimes in winter it's not enough and we put uh, ice snow with water just to make additional insulation yeah. Our house is heated by gas. This is a gas line. It's provided by the government. And here is our thermometer. Let's check the weather. So it's minus 43. And now when we know the temperature, let's go inside. The gas line goes inside of the house to the gas meter. My parents use around 1200 cubic meters of gas per month during the coldest time of the year and it costs them around 5 or 6 thousand rubles per month. This is a gas heater. Today it is set at 60 degrees Celsius and this temperature is enough to heat the whole house. There is a heating radiator in every room of our house, except the second floor. The second floor has only one heater, because it's heated naturally. Warm air from the first floor goes to the second and warms it up. And yes, our house is warm enough for plants. Talking about the windows. Every window has three layers of glass. This is enough to protect us from the cold winter days. And now let's check the temperatures. The temperature of a radiator is around 60 degrees, as we said the heater. The temperature of the window is not that warm because it goes outside as well as the walls. They are also not so warm. The walls between the rooms are warmer. They are around 20 degrees Celsius. The floor is quite cool because the house stands on the ground. However, the ceiling is warmer. We check the temperatures inside of the freezer just for comparison. And no wonder, it's colder outside of our house than inside of a freezer. <laughs> if you want to know why we need a freezer at home, most of our frozen food is stored in not heated part of our house. But it's not so convenient to go outside every time we need frozen veggies, for example. That's why we have a freezer at home. And also, we have just a normal fridge to keep there fresh fruits, milk and etc. And now 
answer my question. Do you heat houses where you live? And if you do, tell me more about your heating system. It's interesting. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Are you done? Argus. Emre evinde. Argus gel ya. Emre ye. Hoğda. Çık